Assalamualaikum, welcome to Farm and Farm. And today in this video, we will learn how to apply moisture to granules or how to moisture in the granules. If you have not subscribed my channel, first of all, press the subscribe button. And now let's start our video. What is the meaning of this statement? Mean, what is the meaning of applying the moisture to granules or moisture in the granules? The meaning of this statement is to apply the moisture to the granules mean we apply the solvent to already granulated product at the compression stage. Next one is that when to apply the moisture mean when we apply the moisture to the granules it is a conventional method and we apply the moisture to granules when we face the capping issue in the tablet or lamination issue in the tablet during the compression process why to apply the moisture it is a very important question mean why we apply moisture to the granules we are familiar that one of the most important reason of tablet capping is the over dried granules mean when there is no moisture inside our granules then the tablet capping and lamination issues are observed so we apply the moisture to granules to overcome the issue of the tablet capping or lamination how to apply the moisture this is the conventional method so in this video we will discuss a conventional method which is used to overcome the tablet capping and lamination issue in the pharmaceutical industries and one of the most important point to remember is that we always use that solvent to moisture the granules which was used at the kneading stage mean if we were using water at the granulation stage then we will use water to moisture our granules and if we used organic solvent like ipa then we will use the ipa to moisture our granule so how to apply the moisture or how we can moisten our granules for this we take some quantity of our product suppose that we have a bag size of 50 kg and we will take 10 kilograms from this 50 kg batch and will apply a suitable quantity of solvent to this 10 kg of the granules one easy and conventional method to check the quantity of solvent either it is sufficient or not is that after applying the moisture we take some quantity of the granules in our hand and if a lump type material is formulated then it is considered that the solvent quantity is okay then we sieve this 10 kg of the granules through a suitable sieve and add remaining portion of the granules in a blender mean we will add 40 kilograms in the blender and after sieving this 10 kilogram will also be added in the blender and will mix it for two to three minutes to uniformly distribute the moisture which was applied to 10 kg to the overall batch so after the application of the moisture the batch is again removed out of the blender and it is compressed sample is taken and check its friability again and if there is no capping and lamination then we will compress the whole batch one important point is to calculate the weight of the applied moisture to the weight of the tablet if you have not clearance about this point must mention in the comment box i will explain this point so i hope now you are familiar that how the moisture is applied to the granules and this practice may vary pharma to pharma but i have tried to explain you the most conventional and easy method which is used to apply the moisture one main thing to remember is that if you are not using this method in routine practice and you want to go towards the application of moisture 
then you will have to generate a deviation for your batch because this behavior was unusual so you will create a deviation and then investigation will be performed and the root cause will be detected and will try to be eliminated the root cause why we need to apply the moisture one key factor to remember is that always try to maintain a suitable moisture in your product after the drying stage and critical monitoring of the moisture is very necessary because if our granules are over dried then we have to go towards the moisture application step i hope now you are familiar with this concept if you like the video share it to others subscribe my channel till the next video allah hafiz